hi everyone and welcome back to our youtube channel all right guys today we're going to be talking about equano road and this happens to be one of the most important road in equano a road that connected to Aquaibom, calabar michael opera university of agriculture and this road has been ignited for a very long time but before we dive into the video before we get into the video i would want you to share this video okay share this video let it get to the people in power let them know that an important road like this need to be fixed now on here as you can see on the chart i've got a name uh, i've got list of people who had ruled in the past and still name of the current governor who is still running up until now um, now let's start from anthony obi anthony obi was ministry administrator who took abia state august 1998 may 29 1999 when ojozakalu took over from him and when Ojozakalu was the governor nothing particularly was done about this road then TA OG took over from Ojozakalu and nothing particularly was really done about this road now Okeze Ibazo is the current governor of Abia state and nothing particularly have or has done about this particular road now, if you're wondering who Anthony Obi is, um, as we proceed with the video, I have got an article where I will explain a little bit about him. I want to explain a little bit about Anthony Obi for the benefit of those who doesn't know who Anthony Obi is. Anthony Obi was a Nigerian limited colonial who served as a military administrator of Bushun State August 1996 to August 1998. During the military regime of General Sanu Abacha, he then became a military administrator of Abia State in August 1998, handling over power to the civilian governor Ojuzokalu in may 1999 all right um i i i quickly want to you know tell you guys i want you to share this video please share this video let it get to people in power something needs to be done about this particular road we are vlogging and i saw this particular place and it caught my attention people that lives in the communities in Equano. I tell you, they suffer before they could be able to travel from their communities, their villages to the town. So share this video, let it get to people in power. And here is a photo of Anthony Obi. Then Oji Zakalo. Former governor T.A. Oji. The current governor, Okeze Ibazu. So here is the road. You see how bad it is? Now, if you look there now, you see a vehicle. You see how the vehicle is suffering to come out from there. This is how bad it is. Particularly, people that live in this community, I know how they suffer before they will be able to get their car out, before they will be able to get to the town. Is this bad? Share this video. Something must be done about this road. So, on this road down to Michael Opera University of Agriculture, it's the same thing. Now, look here. Look closely here. You see potholes. The same thing. Then from here to Indoru Junction, the same problem. You see potholes here and there. This is Indoru Junction. The main place where you bought a bus before you get to Michael Opera. It's the same thing. Down to Michael Opera, the same problem. So help us share this video. The video must get to people in power. They must fix this road. We, the people that live in this community, we suffer before we'll be able to get to town. Something must, something needs to be done about this road. Sorry, I ranted a little bit. So that's it basically. This is Umideke and um, the same thing. If you check here, this is the school gate. It's not good looking. They must do something about the uh, about this road particularly. Alright guys, so I will leave you here and the lockdown in Umaya is not that serious. We are still doing well. Uh, the lockdown is opening a little bit gradually and yeah, I will leave you here and definitely I will see you on the next video. Please, if you have been watching with us, subscribe and subscribe to our YouTube channel and I will see all of you on the next one. Bye.